congratulations on the film and your performance. Thank and you. uh, the obvious one, uh, the first uh, first Yamalan uh, movie, right? Yes. You. Yeah, yeah. How was the experience, and uh, is something uh, that it stood out for you? I mean, the experience working with Knight was was great. In 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 uh, sort of direct contrast to his work and what he writes, his character on set is very warm and inviting and 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 careful, deliberate, and. Um, and I, I, I enjoyed working with him because this character needed, my character that I had to play, needed uh, a lot of sort of room and sort of gentle sort of space to kind of make it as wild as possible. Um, and he was he was very encouraging throughout the whole thing. How about Cooper? Because uh, was there a certain challenge playing him because he has a sinister side? Yes, he has a sinister <laughs> side. It's very, very challenging to play a character like this because you're not just playing one character. You're playing someone who's got a lifetime of cover-up kind of over him. So it's not it's not just the character. It's the mask that he's, that he's carrying in front of him. And then that mask begins to crack. And we had to show how that cracks and why it cracks in the way that it does and what, he, his, what his reaction in the moment is going to be to that, which could be anything. And we just had to come up with something that was going to be... Simultaneously, I think psychologically accurate, but also entertaining. And I wanted him to be, I wanted this character to be fun and bright and full of different colors. So not too dark, even though it is a dark character. Mm -hmm. So you talked about the mask. I noticed that in many sequences, the camera is right at your face. Yeah. Was that a different kind of experience for you? And uh, what does it, what does it require? From an actor, um, I think you are you referring to the scenes in which I'm kind of looking into the camera. Yeah, and yeah, that's right a rare. That's a well, right in your face. That happens all the time in yeah. film because you know close-ups are always right there. But so that's not different. But for me to look right into mm-hmm. the lens, that was different, and I think uh, that created an intimacy with the with the audience that I knew it was going to create, which allowed me to kind of have those moments where you're seeing behind behind the mask. Um, and have it be just for the audience as opposed to for the other character that you're working with. So you can really see the kind of inner workings of the character. And that that's fun to be able to play with that that notion that the audience is getting into something that the other character in the scene can't really see. And for the most part, you're playing along a really young actress, right? Yeah, uh, my, my daughter in the piece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 How is that? Do, do you have a, a bit of a mentoring to her? Mentoring? No, Ari's one of the most professional actors I've ever worked with. Mm. She's She was, like, she came incredibly prepared. She has a really kind of light and effervescent energy, and it helped contrast, I think, some of the things that my character was going through. But also, she's a kid, so she had to, she had to come in and do her work, but she also had to do school during the day, and it became like a, it became a very, you know, a, a lot of work for her. And also... The performance of Salika on stage as Lady Raven was was engaging enough that everybody all in the audience, including Ari, was really taken by by the music that they were listening to. And that was just that that made it the whole experience a lot more fun for them. And for 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 me, I just got to play off of her energy and kind of keep it buoyant and excited and be interested in what she was interested in. Thank you. Yeah? Thank, Thank you. you. Your time is up. All right, cool.